foremost, I just want to welcome you to the team, welcome you to the Freedom Club, uh, having the ability to have your bills eliminated. That's the amazing thing about this business. I love it because even the richest man in the world cannot pay off a cell phone bill, can't pay off an internet bill, can't pay off a cable bill. But we as consumers, we ain't billionaires, but we have now the opportunity to have our bills completely paid for, therefore eliminating our bills and having a, a company, which is this lovely company, Vitale Pan out there. So welcome to the team, the first step to your future, a new you and a new life. But okay, um, let me tell you one of the most essential things that you have to learn, you know, this is really not hard. One of the main things you have to learn and have to become is become a master at the invitation. That's all you have to do to see success in your business. You must become a master inviter. You never want to get to the point where you're trying to give people a presentation without the tools. You're trying to say, well, you can get paid for this and you get paid for that. And we get to do all these things. And you go to the website and you earn when somebody get this. And, and you tell them about all the benefits because you give people an overload and they're overwhelmed and really you know, don't completely understand. So you allow the tools to do that. But what you become a master at is piquing people interest. That's all you do. You pique people interest. And the sense of how commercials do. We have commercials that come on all day long while we're watching TV. And all they're trying to do is pique our interest. So they're giving us a minute and a half to two minute commercials or 30 second commercials that pique our interest. They're giving us enough information to want to know more. So that's all we're doing. And you can make that a part of your everyday life. You cannot use the excuse to say you don't have time for this business because you see people and you talk to people every day. And all you're doing is making it a part of your everyday life. Even when you small talk conversations, just find a way to slide it in in order to pique their interest. And that's what you must become. Learn how to become a minute and a half to two minutes or 30 second commercial where you pique people interest and get them excited to want to know more about the company and their information. Um, this is one of the ways that I do it. Um, a lot of times you may see people, you know, they have their phones out looking at their phones or uh, uh, scrolling through their phones or something like that or you might be you know in a restaurant or you might be you know with your with a waitress or you might be or uh, anywhere um, that you're walking around in the day and especially, especially this is one of the ways I do I see somebody with a phone you know I, I go and say hey how you doing um, I'm into you know cell phones and different things like that I just want to know uh, what type of phone do you have or what type of plan do you have and you know, they tell me the type of phone and what type of plan that they have. And um, I let them know. I was like, well, look, uh, I asked them first, are you from in this area? And they'll tell me, yes, I'm from this area. And they'll tell me, no. I tell, and I tell them this, well, look, if I can show you a way that you can have that cell phone that you have paid for every month, you can totally eliminate your cell phone bill with that interest you. Now, this is the part where you shut your mouth. And you let them answer yes or no. Usually they'll say yes. And I tell them there's two ways that um, you will have the ability to be able to get your cell phone bill paid for. I said a lot of your top Fortune 500 companies like your Verizon, your T-Mobile, um, your different cell phone companies, they're having problems getting their message conveyed to the customer. You know, you got DVRs that cut out commercials on TV. You got satellite radio that cut out commercials. So they're having a hard time getting a message conveyed to the customers. And what they start doing now is having other points of distribution. That's why when you go into other stores now, you may go into Best Buy and see cell phones. You may go into Radio Shack and see cell phones. You may go into Walmart and see cell phones because they are trying to find where people are going. That's why it's not just cell phones at the Verizon store, at the Sprint store, at the T-Mobile store. Now you have other authorized dealers where you go in, they're trying to get their message conveyed. So now they're putting their phones in Best Buy, putting their phones in Radio Shack, putting their phones in your, your grocery stores and your family dollars and general dollars because they're trying to get their message conveyed. So they have in other points of uh, distribution. And now what they're doing now is allowing us as consumers, because the best form of advertising is word of mouth. 
So they are willing to pay us for our word of mouth advertising. And just telling people about their deals. They're willing to pay our cell phone bill every month, eliminate our cell phone bill for doing that. And you might ask, well, why is this or how is this possible? Well, if you take these cell phone companies, they're already paying their employees that work for them. They pay them vacation. They pay them holiday pay. They pay them sick pay. And they pay them weekly and monthly commissions. And they say, well, look, if I can just have a consumer through word of mouth advertising, just telling um, the people and their influence about our deals, and all I have to do is just pay them up to $125 of their cell phone bill, I'd be willing to do that because they're saving me money as a company. I don't pay insurance on them. I don't pay, um, give them a monthly um, uh, vacation pay, sick pay, nothing. All I'm doing is paying their cell phone bills and allowing them to profit off of the people that they bring into my company. Now we can share revenue with the consumers because we are looking to find other means of distribution. So after I tell them this, you know, you can shorten it or make it longer, I tell them this and I ask them, I look, if I can sit down with you and show you completely the way that you are able to take advantage of this, where this interests you, and you wait on them to say, yeah, 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 that interests me. Well, look, let me get your name and your number, and we can sit down and do a full presentation. I can let you understand the whole scope of things, because this is not just with cell phones, but it's with other household um, services also, too. And that's it. You write down their name and number, and then um, give, write down their name and number, and then take it down, send them to the website, let them see the whole presentation as a whole and call them back and ask them if they're ready to move forward.